comes out firing and lands a right hand to drive Bo into the ropes. Great, there you go. Stand Make back. it Biggs, not Bo. But as you can see, Tyrell Biggs is fighting from a flat-footed stance, which is very, very unusual for him. None of the side-to-side -side movement, not on his toes. Lead left hook just missed for Lewis. Now two right hands land, and another. And Biggs ties him up. Lennox Lewis look, looks like much the stronger guy physically, Jim. Looks like he can handle uh, Tyrell on the inside. It was a solid jab from Biggs, and now he tries to follow up to the body and lands twice. And Lewis continues to step forward. Uppercut is solid, and Terrell Biggs Great, once Lando. again pinned against the ropes. And Biggs with a left to the body and a left over the top. Good stiff left hook by Tyro Biggs. And Jim, this is the first time I've ever seen him fight this way, completely flat-footed and really trying to bang away. Lennox Lewis. There's a good stiff jab. And another. And there's the right hand he was supposed to follow with. Very little head movement for Lewis. Could be a problem later on, particularly for a guy who's six feet five inches tall. And down goes Biggs from the solid right cross. That was a good solid right hand right on the chin. Seven. Eight. Terrell's going to get up at eight. Here we are. Gets a little breather. He showed courage against Bo. And there's another right hand, and that might be it. Two, three, I think that Tyrell is starting four, to think that to himself, five, Jim, that that might, six, might be it. Not he's going to make one more try. Eight. You okay? You want to go? No three knockdown rule in effect here. No three knockdown rule. So Terrell can go down again without automatically being out of the fight. Both knockdowns are on the right cross. Lewis throws another one. Biggs goes down again, and the referee's seen enough. That's an impressive victory for Lennox Lewis. A good scalp to have.